Well, thousands of Coastal Bend residents have now received the COVID-19 vaccine, and experts say that is a step in the right direction when it comes to herd immunity. Even so, it is still a ways off. We could be talking about several months. Our Ashley Gonzalez explains. Herd immunity. It's a term being talked about around the world, but what exactly does it mean? According to the CDC, herd immunity is a situation in which a sufficient proportion of a population is immune to an infectious disease through a vaccine and or prior illness to make it spread from person to person unlikely. Medical expert Dr. Salim Sarani says there are two ways a community can achieve this. Number one, either you have a person who is infected and has developed antibody or you have a vaccination and person has antibody. Dr. Srani says with recovered COVID-19 patients and vaccinated residents combined, herd immunity is still way down the road. We have about seven or eight percent of the population which has been infected. And on the other hand, we have about three percent of the people who have been vaccinated. So that's about 10 or 11 percent. Dr. Chris Bird with the task force says so far, not one country has reached herd immunity. However, some countries have been able to cut back on almost all restrictions. He says the entire coastal bend doesn't have to wait for the vaccine to get on the other side of the pandemic. All we have to do is take COVID-19 serious and do our part in stopping the spread. Countries where people are able to not wear masks, those are the countries where they were able to control COVID to the point where Almost nobody has it. They say the overall goal among medical experts is to vaccinate the world, but that could take longer than we think. To get the global vaccination, it's going to take a whole year and even extend into 2022. And because it'll take a long time, it is up to us to bring the infection rate down. They say countries like New Zealand and Australia already did away with mass mandates, and they did it without achieving herd immunity. Instead, the majority of residents followed all CDC health protocols. Experts say if they can do it, so can we. Ashley Gonzalez, 3 News.